Hey everybody, it's Carrie from the Rapid City Public Library, your friendly neighborhood makerspace librarian, back for another science short. And today we are going to be looking at something called a water xylophone. So a xylophone is a musical instrument. Usually they're made out of wood or I think metal, but today we are going to make it out of glass jars and water and learn a little something about sound. So which one of these two jars, the pink or the green, do you think is going to have a higher sound? If you guessed pink, you got it right. But why is that? To start with, sound is a vibration and it travels as a wave through things. In this case, it's traveling through the water that we have in these jars. When there's less water, the vibration travels faster and makes a higher sound. When there's more water, the vibration travels slower and gives us a lower sound. So we filled up a bunch of glasses with a bunch of different levels of water. You can see them get higher and higher and higher. What do you think will happen to the pitch of each of those jars as we tap on them? Let's take a look. So you can see the more water in that jar, the lower the tone. And the less water in the jar, the higher the tone. I'm not sure how musical I am, but we're going to we're going to try to do a song now. So not perfect, but did anybody recognize that? It's a little song called Hot Cross Buns. <laughs> and there you go. Not too difficult to make, kind of difficult to master, and a lot of fun to play around with. Thank you for following along, and I hope we'll see you back next week for another Science Short.